driving through the lava fields to Fire Mountain. Ken the Killick Stone Bear is here eagerly awaiting his first view of a volcano. So now you do have to pay. When I used to come years ago it was all free but now you have to pay and it's just gone up to 40 euros uh, not per person, 40 euros for a couple, so 20 euros each. It did it used to be 12, and it has now gone up to 20 euros each. Put it up on the 1st of January, which is a little bit annoying. If you do it, do it once. This will be the last time we will do it. I've done it about four or five times, but be, we're doing it because Mark has never done it, have you? No. Is it cash or is it card? I hope it's card, because I don't have cash. The mountains of fire. So we're just in the queue waiting to pay the man to get in the park and they do take card, thankfully. So this is the ticket that you get and the bus is included in the price. Well, I should think so as well. What do you say, Ted? So, well, lot, says. You're not allowed to get out of your car at any point until you get to the car park. Because as you can see, well, you probably can't there. As you can see, it's uh, a little bit rocky and it'll probably cause congestion. So we're just driving up to the car park to park up. Oh my God. So we are on the bus tour. Got straight on, literally within 10 minutes of getting here, parking up. So it is just gone 1 p.m. So a very good time to come. Um, if you want to get straight in and on. There was absolutely no queuing at all. So this bus drive is included in the tour, going around the tops of the volcanoes. Um, very, very skilled drivers. It extends over an area of 807 square kilometers is of volcanic origin. This island arose from the ocean some 25 million years ago as a result of the accumulation of material from repeated eruptions. In 1726 and 1730, frequent earthquakes and audible underground rumbling caused panic among the population of the interior who fled seeking refuge in Tegiza and Arecifa. Did you think it was worth 20 your way? Yeah, well, I'm sure it was the whole experience. Yeah, it's not just a coach trip. It is very, very good. Now we're getting up to see some geezers. Right, old geezers. <laughs> oh, it's warm today, a bit of a wind, but it's about 23 degrees today. Yeah, it is. might get a bit hungry when you go in here. <gasps> Look at that, heat from the earth. Better not drop the camera down there. Oh. It's warm. Here we are, there's tonight's steak. Yeah. And this is the restaurant. Timofea, so you can go and have your steak, which has been grilled for you over from the heat of the volcano, and then you can come and sit and munch away out overlooking this at a price, I'm sure. Look at that, beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. There's the grill again. Is that me, Senoris? 
so we've had to hide in the shadow of a bus because of the blooming wind. But that was really good. What did you think for your first experience yeah, of Fire Mountain? Yeah, it's a good trip. Definitely worth it. And you know what? There was no queue. So everybody was saying, oh, you've got to queue for hours. Go on a bus tour. Go on an organised trip. Well, we didn't want to do that because we just paid for car hire. And I'm so glad that we didn't because it's been absolutely quick in and out, an hour and a just half. straight, you know, straight in, straight around. Have a look around and show you the geezer and then they showed you the burning of the um, gorse. And we were straight on the bus as soon as we parked up. So maybe it's a good time to come mid-January. It has gone quite quiet on the island because obviously you've had the rush from Christmas and New Year. And the next rush I'd imagine will be February, wouldn't it? For I imagine term. for half term, yeah. So we've had a good time. We're very pleased, happy with the money we've spent. It was, it was good. Yeah, it was good. So now we are off somewhere else. We've been to some bodegas. Um, they were really good. There was a model village uh, and one of them. That was really interesting. And I think we're going now to Costa to Guise. So we're going to end this vlog here right now. Uh, catch us on the next one. We've still got the car. We're still going to be traveling about. Tomorrow we're doing the Caves of Verdi. We're doing Costa to Guise and the north of the island. So stay tuned. Don't forget to subscribe because I never say it and I'm always, always getting told off. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up because apparently that makes the video circulate more. Who, we are who knew? Who knew? You take care. Thanks for staying and watching. Thanks for your fab comments. Really, really appreciate it. And we'll see you again the next time. See you soon. Bye. Bye.